the mini IP international personality item pool representation of the DO by our scale. So in this video, I'm going to uh, demonstrate to you the self scoring method. Instructions below are phrases describing people's behaviors. Please use the rating scale below to describe how accurately each statement describes you. Describe yourself as you generally are now not as you wish to be in the future. Describe yourself as you honestly see yourself in relation to other people you know of the same sex as you are and roughly your same age. Please read each statement carefully and put a number from 1 to 5 next to it to describe how accurately the statement describes you. So in here, we have the rating scale. 1, very inaccurate. 2, moderately inaccurate. 3, neither inaccurate nor accurate, or moderately accurate, and 5, very accurate. So, describe yourself as you generally are now, not as you wish to be in the future, meaning to say, how you perceive or evaluate yourself from this point of time or from this present period, and not as you wish to be in the future. Describe yourself as you honestly see yourself. So be honest when answering this type of a short personality test. So please read each statement carefully. Alright, so what you're going to do, so you just put a number, okay, put a uh, number that represents how accurate it describes yourself. So I've already put my own uh, answer on this uh scale on this personality test okay to make a more um, good explanation okay when we go to the scoring system all right so now I answered it by myself so for example number one I put number two so moderately inaccurate I'm the life of the party okay the number two so I sympathize with other feelings which is very true and that is why it is very accurate for me. So I put number 5. Okay? So that's how simple it is to uh, answer it. Okay? And then up until you get or you get to the uh, number 20 or 20 items. Okay? You answered all the 20 items. And as you may have noticed in here, there is a parenthesis. So this talks about the uh, scoring system. But later on, we're going to uh, talk about that, okay? And then in here, after the uh, each statement, we have a Q letters which represent the uh, big five trait. So E stands for extraversion, A for agreeableness, C for consensusness, and for neuroticism, then O for openness, okay? So now, after you've done that, I mean, after you uh, answer all the items, on this uh, the mini IP scale or this uh, personality short personality test now let's proceed to the scoring system so in here scoring the first thing you must do is to reverse the items that are worded in the opposite direction in order to do this subtract the number you put for that item from 6 so if you put a 4 for instance it will become a 2 Cross out the score you put when you took the scale and put the new number in representing your uh, score subtracted from the number 6. So what you're going to do is to uh, uh, have these items to be reversed in this way. So 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. So these are the list of the items to be reversed. So, what you're going to do is just subtract it from the number 6. Simply subtract uh, this list of numbers on each value, okay, of these numbers, subtract it from the number 6. Same for example, so what value I put on number 6? So, I put number 2, okay, moderately inaccurate. So, this is my original uh, answer okay number two but because it is subjected to a uh, reverse item and that is why I, I'm just going to uh, 
uh, subtract it from the number 6. Okay, and there you have it. I got 4 for my final uh, points or rating for this um, uh, number. Okay, and so on and so forth. So, for example, 1. So, minus 6 minus 1 is equal to 5. 6 minus 5 is equal to 1. 6 minus 4 is equal to 2. 6 minus 1 is equal to 5. So, that's how it's simple it is. So, you just need to follow this order, this pattern on what to uh, subtract from the number 6. This, are this, this is the list. Okay? Now, uh, for you to have a shortcut method or shortcut way of uh, scoring, like you just need to, for example, uh, 1, the equivalent of 1 when reverse, okay, when you see the opposite direction, 1 is to 5, then 2 is to 4, then uh, 3 is to 3, okay, 3 is to 3, then uh, 4 is to 2, okay, then 5 is to 1, okay, so when you see the uh, list of 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and look at to the opposite direction, you will get this pattern. So 1 is to 5, 2 is to 4, 3 is to 3, 4 is to 2, so 5 is to 1. It's like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Okay, in the opposite direction, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So the next thing you need to do is to add up the scores for each of the five ocean scales, including the reverse numbers where relevant. Each ocean score will be the sum of four items. Place the sum next to each scales below. So open S, we need to add 5, 10, 15, 20. So I'm going to add 5, 10, 15, and another 5, so 20. So I got 20 for my openness. The next we have consensusness 3, 8, 13, 18. 5, 6, 11, 15. So 15 for consensusness. The next we have extra version 1, 6, 11, 16. So 2, 6, 9, 12. So I got 12 for extra version. Next, second to the last, agreeableness 2, 7, 12, 17. So 5, 10, 15 and plus 4, 19. So I got 19 for agreeableness. And lastly, neuroticism for 9, 14, 19. So 2, 4, 5, and plus 1, 6. Okay, so there you have it. I got 6 for neuroticism. Then for interpretation, so for openness, I got 20. Therefore, it is said to be extremely high. Then consensusness, um, high. And then extraversion is 12, so neither high nor low or in the middle, meaning to say in between of extraversion and introversion. Okay, that is the result I got. Then agreeableness, uh, 19, I got uh, extremely high. Then neuroticism, I got so very low. So try it for yourself to see the result. Okay, so this is my, uh, actually, my own results that I got from this uh, personality test. Okay, so I hope you got it. You followed the right instruction. Okay, correctly. So thanks for listening.